जय हिंद दोस्तों आई एम अभिषेक एंड इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ यू कैन कनेक्ट योर यू एस पी जोस्टिक विद योर पी सी एंड यू कैन प्ले गेम्स इन योर पी सी विद द हेल्प ऑफ योर जोस्टिक आई नेवर मेक वीडियोज इन इंग्लिश बट द टॉपिक ऑफ दिस वीडियो इज समथिंग लाइक दैट सो आई हैव टू मेक दिस वीडियो इन इंग्लिश इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कनेक्ट योर यू एस बी जोस्टिक फॉर माई हिंदी पीपल सो यू कैन फॉलो दीज स्टेप्स और यू कैन मैसेज मी इन इंस्टाग्राम आई विल गाइड यू इन हिंदी सो आई नो दैट दिस वीडियो ऑडियंस इज गोइंग टू बी इंटरनेशनल सो दैट्स वाई आई एम मेकिंग दिस वीडियो इन इंग्लिश यू कैन फॉलो दीज स्टेप्स एंड यू कैन इजिली कनेक्ट योर यू एस बी जोस्टिक विद योर पी सी एंड प्ले गेम्स So as you can see I have many games like GTA 5, WWE 2K20, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, Snow Runner, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 and Call of Duty Modern Warfare which is an online game. So I have tested all these games with this solution so all games are working perfectly. I have tried many games like Red Dead Redemption 2, Watch Dogs 2. All games are working perfectly with these steps. So this is very simple step guys. I have created and setting folder already so you don't need to download any other external file. You just need to download only one file. So first of all go to this video's description you will found a link there like media file link this type so open that link and download this 15 mb gamepad settings file so once you click on download your download will be started as you can see my down my file is downloading so that's where all right so you can see my file is downloaded this file so this is a rar file so we will come to this file later so first thing you need to do is to connect your usb gamepad with your pc or laptop so i have already connected and then go to your control panel then hardware and sound and then go to device and printers okay and then you can see usb generated joystick here so right click on this and go to game controller setting and make sure guys this status is showing okay if it is not okay then go to pro properties and then configure your usb joystick from here go to settings and set this to reset default and then click on calibrate then next next then move your analog left analog you can see this is working perfectly then next then rotate your right analog so this is also working perfectly now on the z index side means up to down then you can see this is also working perfectly and make sure guys this you can see this blue line it is it is important to be this line in the center okay if it is not in center so maybe your joystick is damaged then click on finish and check your all buttons here as you can see i'm pressing buttons in my joystick and it is like that okay then click on apply and your joystick is configured now what you need to do is go to your download folder and click on this file which you have downloaded earlier right click on this file and select extract to game pad settings and here you need a password to so watch password so guys this is the password b is capital and all things are in small so make sure you enter the right password so your file will be extracted as you can see after extracting i got a gamepad settings folder like that so in this folder i have another gamepad folder and i have these all kind of files you can see there are many files are there size is very low guys you can see 27.9 mb and this is the size of this folder and just copy these files and then go to your desktop or where your games are installed right click on a game then select second option open file location just paste it here if it is asking for replace then replace all the files you can see i have pasted all the files here then same steps for all games brand new music acro then paste all files here as you can see i have already pasted all files in my all games root directory so you can paste these files like that okay so now is the testing time guys so okay firstly i will like to open my wwe 2k20 so let's open this it is telling me to press a button so i press the button then you can see it is working perfectly as you can see i am moving from here you can see this is moving perfectly you can see this is working perfectly press a button so i press the button then you can see it is working perfectly as you can see i am moving from here you can see this is moving perfectly you can see this is working perfectly 
guys this is it this is a simplest way to connect your usb joystick with your pc and you can play any game i know you have watched many videos but uh, none of them are working for you let me tell you one thing guys i have also seen many videos in youtube which they are showing different ways like download x360 software and then configure your joystick from there and select x input and something like that these things are working guys i assure you i have tried these things already i have also tried those things and these those things works for me but you know guys there are many people who don't know about what is x360 what is x input file and how to configure them they don't know about that so that's why i have configured all the settings and put them into one file and you just need to copy and paste those files and your joystick will be working perfectly you don't need to download any software or you don't need to configure any setting you just have to copy or paste that's it guys thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you in the next time they looking up to me they want the best of me now best of me now best of me now best of me they want the best of me now best of me now